So let's talk about how hackers make money, because they're not doing this out of the generosity of their heart or their love for hacking in most cases. In fact, as we've talked about in another video, most hackers are employed by basically big criminal syndicates in big off and they work in big office buildings and they go to you know an eight to five job or I'm sure they have shifts of course but just like anybody else so how do these organizations make so much money well number one lately has been ransomware attacks because that can make them just millions of dollars in the span of a few hours with people paying the ransoms because they've got to get their information back. Especially if they're able to target a large organization, they can get just a several million dollar payday super quickly. Now, the other ways they make money, though, are by selling access to the computers they've hacked because it's a common misconception that like a hacker is going to put a big little blaring banner up on your screen when they've hacked you. That's just not the way it usually works. Typically, they're in there six to nine months uh, before anybody even knows because they're trying to remain undetected. They want to see, okay, what information do you have that I could sell? So that's one way they make money in addition to things like ransomware. Think of ransomware, too, as kind of the last little thing that happens before, uh, you know, they're finally ready to just say, all right, well, I'm ready to be exposed. Let me try to get a final payday here after they've gleaned everything else. They can sell access to your systems. So those uh, other hackers can buy it and launch attacks against other organizations using your computer systems, your network connection, believe it or not. They can, of course, sell your information. They can, uh, try to uh, get a bribe to keep, you know, they've stolen your information and they won't publish it, but you've got to pay them. And then, of course, there are things that they can sell. their hacking tools. Um, they can sell these exploits that they've discovered that if nobody else knows about them, they can sell those to other hackers before those become widely known. Uh, there's a lot of ways these guys can make money, but it is billions of dollars a year that this is this hacking industry. You, know, you think about all the maybe the cost for cybersecurity and those are going up. Well, simple reason is, is because hacking is getting more and more profitable because companies especially are not taking the precautions they should. And that's one of the big things, one of the big pushes in cybersecurity that we're all trying to do is you know, protect everything so these ransoms aren't as profitable, so ransomware starts to die out, uh, so that these other attacks, so that them being on systems persistently for weeks and months is not something that happens, so it becomes less profitable. It drives their costs up, and they're going to have to then shift tactics, we hope, to something much less destructive. So that's the way hackers make money, and it's a very profitable enterprise, something that you know even your lone hacker can make a good amount of money, but especially these big companies uh, that do the lead these hacking can make a whole lot of money off of your information and your compromised systems. So it's something you've got to take seriously, and you've got to have a plan to deal with.